Hello and welcome to the Career Tutorials. My name is Xavier Tan. In this tutorial, we'll talk about the Career Controller. Every Carrera controller has two buttons. The one on the upper side, you need this button to speed up. That means if you push this button down, your car will accelerate. If you want to brake, you have to release this button. It is especially very important before a bend that you really brake and not drive too fast in this bend by just push it down and holding it like this, your car will spin off the track. What's also very important is the boost button. You need this boots button to pass a ramp, to jump over it, or to pass the looping. You need to push and hold this button down during you pass the looping. That is very important, otherwise your car will fall off the track. Equal to real motorsports, you cannot drive at the same speed on the whole circuit. You have to be gently in the bands, and especially you can drive at full throttle on the straights. You cannot drive with full throttle in the bands, otherwise your car will spin off the track. Oops, like this. If you want to pass the looping correctly, you have to push and hold down this turbo button at your trigger finger. If you do that, your car will pass the looping perfectly. So keep on racing. We recommend to build in two straights before and behind a band. That is very important, so you can accelerate before a bend and you can brake behind the bend. You have enough space, for example, uh, at the looping as well, to accelerate and to brake your car down. You need the straights also, for example, for a jumping ramp like this. You can build up great career racing track sets just with your personality. I mean, you can build in a seesaw, you can build in a hump track, you can build a high bank curve, whatever you build in, it will give you more fun, more action, and your own personality. Have fun. We recommend that you use only genuine career products and spare parts.